Hey guys, in this tutorial I want to show you how you can create a black and white effect like this in the Spark AR Studio for your Instagram and Facebook filters. And I will also provide you a free LUT you can use for this filter. So let's start. Hey again, so let's create a black and white filter here in the Spark AR Studio. Before we start creating the filter here in the Spark AR Studio, make sure you have downloaded the free LUT I have provided for you. So just go to the description and click on the download link. Then you will end up here on this Dropbox page. Here just click on download. After the download you will find this black and white.png file in your downloads folder. So after you have downloaded the file we can start creating the filter. The first thing is to import our LUT we have just downloaded. For this we go to our assets panel, click on the little plus then go all the way up to import and here click on color LUT. Now we navigate to our download folder or wherever you have saved your file and then just select the black and white.png file and now just click on open. So the next step is that we go to our assets panel where we now have our color LUT, the black and white color LUT. Just drag and drop it into the patch editor. Spark AR will now automatically create this color LUT shader for us and also um, yeah, wire it up correctly with our LUT patch. The next thing is that we extract the camera texture from our camera element in the scene. So for this we go to the scene panel, click on the camera, then go to the right hand side and here at texture extraction click on this little plus next to it. When you have done this, you will find a camera texture under the textures in your assets panel. And now again just drag and drop the camera texture texture into the patch editor. So now just connect the RGBA output of the camera texture with the texture input of the color LUT shader. The next step is to create a new material. So go to your assets panel, click on the plus and now here select material. I will rename this material to um, black and white. So after you have created this material, select it, go to the right hand side and set the shader type to flat. Now go down to the shader properties and under diffuse you will find this texture here. And now here click on the little arrow next to it. When you have done this you will find this yellow um, patch in your patch editor. The black and white um, patch with the diffuse texture input and now just connect the return output of the color LUT shader with the black and white input of the diffuse texture. So now almost done. The next step is to create a rectangle where we can attach our material to. So for this go to your scene, click on the plus and now search for rectangle. Spark AR will now automatically create this canvas and also the rectangle inside of it. Now select the rectangle, go to the right hand side and set the width to fill width and also the height to fill height. So now this covers the whole screen and now just go down to the materials and now click on the plus and here select the black and white material and now we have successfully created a black and white filter here in the Spark AR Studio for Instagram and Facebook filters. If you like this video and I hope I could help you, give this video a thumbs up and if you are new to this channel and you don't want to miss any um, new Spark AR tutorial I upload here, just subscribe to it. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye!